is well done. You're an Evan Wigwood's Miss Ventura Week. Uh, I'm not, but everybody else is. Good luck in your futures. I hope you do really well. And I'm going to miss my friends. Oh, oh my god! She ruined it! She ruined it! She ruined it! Camera is not like oh, she ruined it! I am ready. Some of the boys in the PSA class. Don't ask me to admit it again, but I will. Good luck on all of your exams, Year 11s, you've got your exams coming up, so I wish you all the best. As you can see, this is one of the last physics classes for top set year 11. I'm gonna miss you guys. Uh, it's been an amazing two years uh, once you guys were in year 10 and 11, so gonna be truly missed. Uh, and yeah, wish you all the best. Okay, so uh, what's the stupidest comment any student has said? Stupidest comment? Uh, Whenever safe opens his mouth, I suppose. <laughs> right, I'm here to talk about the year 11s. Um, we teach English to them for over a year now. I think the biggest shock was when I arrived. Um, Adam will remember, boys' class, girls' class separately. And they kept asking me whether they could watch a video, because that's what they were used to. So I think the biggest shock to them was actually, no, we've got to do some work. But they've been great, we've had lots of fun. Um, sometimes difficult to get the work in, but it's getting there. And of course I've had a year 11 tutor group. Lots of fun with the tutor group. Got Aziz, Mr. Carefree, and my name is. Uh, I know you're alright Aziz, you're here. We've got gorgeous Eunice and gorgeous Aya, Majdi and Zahid, future leaders of the country. And then, of course, Rosa, fellow Brummy. She's had her ups and downs, but she's on an up at the moment, and she's going to do well. So, I'll see you in the ball ring, Rosa, and good luck, everybody. So, hello, and welcome to uh, my classroom. Here is my wonderful classroom here at uh, Sherbourne, Qatar. Um, I'm sending this message to our current Year 11s. Uh, one of the highlights, without a shadow of a doubt, this year has been Stefan's ability to fall over during PE lessons, uh, which is very, very often, and he's very, very funny, and very amusing. Uh, Hamza Altai thinking that he can play football, and obviously Ali Kay, who can play football. Uh, I wish all the Year 11s all the very best. Hello, Year 11. I've been made to do this. I'm not happy. Uh, I'm very, very disappointed in you. No, it's been enjoyable having you for the past two years. Some of the girls I've not had all the time and some of the boys haven't had me, but it has been thoroughly enjoyable. You are a crazy bunch of kids. You annoy me on a regular basis, but in the end you do what you're asked to do. One of my most memorable moments was the trip with the boys to the Corniche. <laughs> for the wrong reasons, all of the code. We got to the Corniche, yes, Oliver, we got to the Corniche, to uh, the park, and the park was closed. Only in Qatar would a park be closed. So we decided to pitch up on the Corniche, we had a nice time, but we had no food. So we decided it would be a great idea to get the bus drivers to take us to McDonald's. 
The bus driver decided to take us to McDonald's. The boys, however, did not decide to hold on to their drinks on the bus. <laughs> Oliver, said milkshake went all over the driver's stuff as we're driving down Khalifa Street. <laughs> We then had to pursue, to try and clear it up in the amount of time given and it didn't work. There was chips everywhere, burger everywhere, and to say the least, the driver was not impressed with us. <clears throat> and that was probably one of the most memorable moments. And I cleared it up. Yeah, and Ollie was made to clear up. Girls, it's been lovely getting to know you. You're too quiet for your own good at the beginning of the year. You need to open your mouths. I think I've said that to Ikram probably a thousand times. Homework. Do your homework. Christian's not here anymore. If Christian was here, I'd be telling him to do his homework. <laughs> That's pretty much it, Year 11. Enjoy the next few weeks. It should be some of the best time of your life. Enjoy your dinner and look forward to the future. Work hard because every single one of you deserves to do well. And good luck. Well, Adam, to be absolutely honest, it's been two years of unrelenting misery, wasting my gift and the laziest, most thankless and useless crowd of people I've ever had the displeasure to teach. As for my best moment, well, that'll be Sunday when you don't come to my class. Favourite student? Zahid, Haya and Lena. So I can't believe that only 11 out of 37 of you have been here since the very beginning. Oh sorry, I was trying to remember the last time Abdullah came to registration. I think it was maybe in November, December? But anyway, um, I really like being a Year 11 tutor. This year's been fantastic. I've had lots of lovely Year 11s in my tutor group who come away most days to registration. All the smiling faces, beautiful uniforms. We've had a great year. Special memories. Mem Mary doing her boxes. Fantastic effort. And the boys constantly talking about football, cricket, rugby every morning. It's been great. Good luck with all your exams. <laughs> Adesso si li vivrò con te, partirò su navi per mari che io lo so, no, no, non esistono più, con te io li vivrò quando sei lontana sogno all'orizzonte. Te manca le parole, e so, so che sei con me. Really going to miss Mary and Nisha who are moving to Pastures New, leaving us here in Qatar. Looking forward to teaching Hannah on the A level. Let's hope she gets that B grade or above. And going to miss my hardworking boys, Marco and Safe, and also my other boys in the class who've always been there grafting away Louis, Hamza, and Ali. Year 11 was so much that I'd rather teach them than have them all money to myself. <laughs> so, what are my most enjoyable moments uh, about teaching Year 11? I would say they're just such a rich tapestry of talent, teaching such great individuals like these gentlemen behind me. They're just their attitude 
is just absolutely brilliant. They're fully committed. They show such effort in the classroom. They never misbehave. They're always on task. It, they're just such such a joy to teach. I will just miss such talented individuals like this. And I will, from the bottom of my heart, gentlemen, I will, I will truly miss you. Um, so, funniest moments, I think, in the school. Oh, gosh. I, I spend so much time nowadays, lunch times, in the playground. And I suppose, uh, looking over here at, at, at Louis, his uh, lack of accuracy, I think, kicking uh, balls, uh, footballs and uh, rugby balls, is just, so many are on the roof now. It's uh, just unbelievable. Um, I will miss uh, Yusuf, he's so expressive with his hands when he does presentations. So I would, uh, I would say to Yusuf, work on those presentation skills. Uh, I, I think what I'll probably miss is my form. I think I've had uh, such an amazing um, form. Nisha, so polite, kind and caring. Um, I just will miss Safe, his punctuality, always there on time. Um, with those cups of coffee, I will miss, I will miss that. Um, just the way that they come and get their reading books out without having to be prompted, it's just, it's, it's absolutely fabulous. And uh, planners on the table, no prompting, I will miss that. So, uh, all the best to Year 11, good luck in your exams. And uh, take care. Every day I just love how Adam comes in and he just he makes my day, he makes me so happy. Yeah, he goes to me. The thing I've enjoyed most about Year 11 is watching a group of little brats who are very frightened who have come and turned into actually a bunch of really nice people and it's been my pleasure to watch you grow up and fun moments, well anybody who was in my Year 9 boys music class you know what all the fun moments were, I don't need to list them all so I wish you all the best of luck, bye. Hello Miss. Hello. Hi. Yeah, have you got, yeah, have you got any uh, words to say about your experiences with your year 11 group? Yeah. Oh, for the love of... <laughs> okay. Um, I just want to say, wish them the very best of luck in their exams. It's been an absolute pleasure teaching them. Some I've had for the last two years, some I had just this year. And I've, it's been absolutely fantastic teaching them. They've been excellent students. And I would say to them, Please try your best. Don't follow the stereotypes that I know we've discussed in the lesson. And for any help on the stereotypes, you can speak to Jason. Um, and I want to wish you the best of luck in whatever you decide to do in the future. Whether you want to be a business person, a fashion designer, uh, want to be a dancer, go to a football team, a web designer, or a Formula One racing driver, Abdullah. And just a few things in Arabic before important things you should note before I let you go. Uh, first one, Fi Sham Salim, Mafi Mata, Wakud, and most importantly, Ali Yuafkik, Fi Elen Kamal. Yeah, I'm just popping in to see Miss Pritchard, our biology teacher. Hi, Miss. Uh, uh... Hi! Oh, yeah. Okay. Excellent. Right. I've been thinking about this a lot, and I have uh, two moments. I'll take my glasses off. I have two moments that it's very, very important that uh, have already stood out for me in the, in the last few years. One, uh, a very fun, light-hearted moment involving a, a lovely young man um, who's very, very famous for two things. One thing is being Italian and extremely handsome. Uh, the other thing is the fact he struggles with words like rabbit, ravishing, 
running rainbows. <laughs> Ridiculous. Uh, that kind of thing. Anyway, this young man, this young man, he, uh, he was in my fall group, my house group last year, and we decided to play a little joke on him. I don't know if you remember, but he had this backpack that was very similar to a shell, a tortoise shell. More of a turtle shell. So uh, Hayden, Mohammed, and I decided to decorate the back of his bag without him knowing. And he walked around with a picture of a teenage mutant ninja turtle on his back, saying, "I fight to climb," which was uh, which was particularly fun. Anyway, it has absolutely no point in this story at all, but. Uh, Year 11, they're a lovely group of people and I will miss them dearly. And I suppose a proud moment for me has probably been working with the, the drama students, the Year 11 drama students, and I wish them all the very, very best and the rest of Year 11 for the future. Good luck! You never try, you'll never know Just what you with their exams and new schools. Success in Chernobyl. shadow of a doubt this year has been Stefan's ability to fall over during PE lessons, uh, which is very, very often, and he's very, very funny, and very amusing. Uh, Hamza Altai thinking that he can play football, and obviously Ali Kay, who can play football. Uh, I wish all the year 11s. <laughs> Just say good luck in your exams, your levels. I was going to say thank you to some of you. In a world where Stefan was normal. You can talk about the oh, wow. bad points of having Go away. The camera slowly. Oh.
Yeah. 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 Right. Yeah. Well, are you filming me from that low down? It's outtakes. Yeah. Right. Ollie, that's going to make you look really fat. It doesn't. You don't look fat, miss. Right. What am I doing now? Okay. You must say five, four, three, two, one. Okay, ready. I'm a stand. You're a stand with us. Do I have to? I don't know. You're the best at all. <laughs> I love the year 11 so much that I'd rather teach them to have all this money to myself. Ah. Imagine if I deleted everything. <laughs> Safe turn up with his massive bag and Stefan with his whole door and the rucksack. And that's a big thing. Okay, ready? Don't move it about because it'd be like, hello! <laughs> okay, three, two, one, go! Okay, <laughs> Go on, there must be one somewhere. That's your yes. <laughs> Here we go, see? Red. Today? Class. I can see the I can know. Got all that stuff out. You know what? It's terrible. I don't even know what I'm saying. Let me think about what I'm going to say. I'm being filmed. Do you want to be filmed here? It's up to you. What you should do is walk in, and I'll be sat here and I'll just turn around and go. Ha ha ha! Amen. Adam. Hi, sir. Sherborne is all about standards. We impose them, they're very important to have very high standards. Success is Sherborne. Oh my god! <laughs> Success, I'm sure.